uh, video today. It's going to be like a weekly, well, this week so far, um, weekly update of how my writing has been going. Uh, so it's April. A lot of um, writers are participating in the Camp NaNoWriMo. It's not like the regular um, NaNoWriMo where you have to do 50,000 words in 30 days in November. You pick your own um, goals, your own project. So what I decided to do for my project was I wanted to see if I could write an additional 30,000 words for the month of April because um, I'm writing a book and I already have a certain amount of words. I don't want to start a new project altogether. So I did that instead. Uh, today is the uh, it's Sunday, the first Sunday of the month. And it's uh, April 5th. There you go. April 5th. I don't even know what day it is anymore. If you're watching this in the future, you know, just so you know, there was a, you know, a little virus thing going around. So, not knowing what day it is, typical this time of the, this time in the world. Uh, so, I already had uh, several thousand words written, so I wanted to get 30,000 more words. The first few days of the month, I didn't write anything at all. But last night, I ended up uh, doing a couple of writing sprints. The first one I did 360 words, the second one I did 526, and the third one 523, and the last one 253. So last night I wrote a total of 1,662 words, which did the math, I would have to do around 1,200 words, give or take, every day from last night to the end of the month to get to 30,000. So I gave myself a little bit of buffer zone there. Uh, see here um my novel that i'm writing it is a Stop memoir right type novel uh i'm writing about stuff that actually happened to me uh i will be before what before i actually uh publish it and send it to get published and whatnot i'm going to be doing uh like changing out all the names for different names Although it is based on actual true facts, some of the people in the in the book are still alive. There's several people in the book that it's surrounding that they've passed away. So I don't know if that's going to matter or not to the people that's still alive. But anyway, I think I might change the names. Also, I also decided that I'm, I've thought up of a pen name that I'll be using. It's the pen name that I use over in um, NaNoWriMo. It's also a name of a character I created on the um, game Neverwinter. So I'm going to be using that name. I'll talk more about the process I came to for my pen name on another video. But, you know, my name is Stephanie. It's a really common name. My sister-in-law has the same last name as me. So I wanted something different, and I don't mind that people know it's a different name. I'm not trying to hide my identity. I just, there's a lot of Stephanie Whitsons out there. There's even an author out there named Stephanie Grace Whitson. So it's not that weird that I'd be picking a different name. And after I write this memoir and get it done, I have plans to write, like, for young adult paranormal with witches and vampires and magic things like that so i don't think that my pen name that i'm going to be uh using is oh, an odd name for the genre that i will be writing in mainly this project that i'm doing the novel on basically my life growing up is i had an idea for the book and I knew when I wanted it to start and where in my life I wanted the book to end. So it was a matter of just like writing it linear. I didn't need to have, I felt like I didn't need to have an outline or to plot it out for the story. But I know that when I start writing in the paranormal genre and I want to have, for example, a series of books all related, I'm going to have to figure out the best way for me to plot an outline. There's lots of different ways you can do it to figure out the best way for myself. So uh, I think that's about it for today. Um, if you have any questions about me, my writing process, or any other types of videos you think you might want to see, comment down, comment down below in the comments and I will be sure to reply. And don't forget to subscribe if you like my channel. Oh.